We're taking a look at some of the most fascinating causes in Lagos, Nigeria. We'll show you what's ticking in the mind of the hottest names in town. And today, we're looking at Karen Koshini. Karen! Come on in. Welcome to Karen's Closet. Karen, thank you so much for having us. Thank you again for letting us in. Okay, for so those of you that do not know, please meet the creative director of Urban Living in Lagos, Karen Kushuli. Thank you for having me. <laughs> Let me take you through. Wow. This house is the most amazing thing I've seen. I'm glad you think so. Thank you so much. <laughs> Exercise. <laughs> welcome, welcome, welcome. Oh, this is amazing. Well, I'm glad you think so. Well, thank you. Oh, my God. No, I will say that. But I, knew it was I will take that compliment. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Welcome, Momo. Thank you Welcome so to my much closet. for having us. Thank you, I Karen. hope it moves up. <laughs> my God, this is like what they call closet heaven. Look at the shoes, though. Yeah. Wow. A bit of a shoe. I knew. Sanitic. I knew. <laughs> okay, tell me now. Now it's time for questions. Okay. Are you ready? Shoot, shoot, shoot. Are you ready? I, I think so. Okay, <laughs> we want to know, what is your classic style? Tell us now. Um... I say ladylike. Ladylike, yes. So if you're defining yourself in one word, you say you were ladylike. I say I was ladylike. Lady Feminine. Like. I was going to ask you that question. Ladylike sexy, ladylike bring it, ladylike feminine. Ladylike feminine. Very nice. With a little touch of sex. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Don't say anything. Okay, so now tell me, in all of this splendor, what was your first luxury life? Uh, first... Can I take a guess? Can I? Let me not take a guess, just shoot us. So, <laughs> this. I've had this for 26 years. Wow! 27, actually. Well, what's yes. this? Yes, so it's my a quilted Chanel bag. Oh my gosh. I bought this when I was in uni. Um, please, yes. So it's all weathered and everything, but I love it. I love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. It's still my, probably one of my favorite buys. What were you feeling? What were you thinking when you bought this? Um, I've achieved something. I know, <laughs> don't want to sound so materialistic, but you know, it's um, every lady wants to own a Chanel That's bag, so you know, and um, so it was a big thing for me when I was able to buy it. Wow. So, yes, and I still love it till today. And you still got this piece. Yes. It's very, very, very beautiful. <laughs> and I like the way that it starts right in front of it. So <laughs> this is your I don't carry it all the time now, but it's still one of my go to pieces. Oh, but how many bags do you have in here? They're so many can we talk about shoes okay what would you say what designer do you think owns the highest percentage in your wardrobe um oh that's a hard one mm. i, I really, can see so many names I, i'm really honestly it's maybe, like the dictionary i think between gucci and um bottega at the moment okay. yes I do love Jen Vita Rossi. Okay. I think I have a few pieces, but I think I would say it used to be um, uh, Christian Louboutin, but I've nice. kind of dressed it. So From yeah, me. I would say Gucci and Bottega at the moment. Wow. Show us your favorite piece. My favorite piece at the moment, I haven't worn them yet though. But this is absolutely nice. <gasps> These are beautiful. <laughs> I knew you would be a good shoe lady. Look at that. Wow. That is amazing. Yes, she so, has not worn them. Those are the yeah, most beautiful. I can't wait pair. to. I'm looking forward to wearing them. Are you going to break them in? Yes. <laughs> what would you say defines your style this season? Do you go through seasons? Um, not really. I think I'm very stable, but I do get attracted to certain styles nice. during the season. And I think I find myself um, recently wearing outfits that show a bit of midriff. Mm. Um, you so, have a midriff to show. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Well, thank you. Thank you for that. I don't really think so. So it's discreet mi uh, midriff, but um, yes, uh, I like, um, I'm really particular about um, 
nice floaty dresses, very feminine dresses, but just a little back showing, you know, a little midriff showing. So yes, I think I'm, I've moved in that kind of direction. And that kind of goes in that same style that you're talking about, that ladylike, yes, feminine, feminine, but a little bit of sexy. sexy at the exactly. Back, <laughs> oh, yes. this is amazing. Can we walk through some of your bags? Because I oh. can see your ladylike coming through here. I can see a lot of colors in your bags. Yes. So, Okay, um, I do have a range of all kinds of bags. Okay. So it's all a bit cluttered up now. I do need to go through and arrange my bags. I tend to, <laughs> so I have my big bags there, which okay. is like the Bottega clutches. And then I have like a mid-sized bag. And these are all my little clutches. Um, my favorite at the moment Let's that see. I can't get enough would be... Oh, small you have a thing pack. for quills. Yes, I do actually. This is so beautiful. <laughs> so is this recent? I do. Um, I've had this. This is recent, but this I've had for a few. Oops. Um, I think about a, a year now. This is really beautiful. So yeah, let me have it in the red. What did you think? Now everybody was talking about the inauguration, weren't they? Yes. And they were talking about it yes. for one reason or oh, one main reason. <laughs> I know that reason. <laughs> I hope. I'm not sure if my answer is going to relate, but go ahead. What did you think about Michelle's outfit? Um, I love the color. Let me put this but back I, for you. I thought it was a bit conservative. Really? A bit. But I did, I did love the color and I, I love the fit on her. I thought it could be a bit more... I'm a detailed person. Oh. It just did not have that detail that I was looking for. What do you for, think she needed? What, what piece should she just thrown in there? Um... I mean, she did have the belt. I think, you know, to be honest, it was the belt that didn't really do it for me. I think it could have been a mm, bit more excited. Yeah. But the color looked beautiful in her. That monochrome made her look like royalty. T yes. I just wanted and to put purple. A crown purple on her is royalty, actually. <laughs> <laughs> so she I did like show. it overall. Everybody else was looking. She was the most elegant. Yes. Yes. And Barack was just standing there going, "That's my woman. That's my woman." <laughs> As usual. <laughs> As should How be. How awesome! How awesome! How awesome! Okay. So now we want to talk about something. Else. A bit more intimate. I did tell you at the beginning of the show, I said, if you give me some access to your wardrobe, I might be able to tell you what kind of person you are. Okay. So I need to see just a little bit more detail because okay. I'm putting this profile together. Okay. So tell what us, you if like you were wearing a longer dress, if you were going out, say, to um, a ball, okay, what would you pick? You um, were telling me that one of your favorite clothes was somewhere in one of these clothes. Yeah, but I, I think I have some that I really like here that I would probably wear. <gasps> and this is a dress from Zimmerman. Okay. There, where's this? Okay. So, and this is me. I love detailing. Okay. Um, so I would wear something like that. This is what you mean it's when you quite say a bit of a... But it's um, asymmetrical, so it slants. Okay. So you have one leg showing, and then the other is covered. I can completely see your shoulders, shoulders are showing as well. Okay. On one side. So yes, this is probably one of my favorite dresses. Aha. When was the last time you decluttered? Because you said you were spilling over. Mm. Um, I think I decluttered. I need to do another declutter, to be honest. Okay. <laughs> I, I desperately actually need to. Do you think you're going to be doing that at my built-in closet? I will. No, no, no. I should, why am I asking this question? I have you no choice. Yes, I will be doing it. I just put closet. this up here. <laughs> what do you think? We might be getting one of these outfits, one of these bags. If you were going to give something away, what do you yes. think you would throw um, in there? Okay. Oh, have you been to my girlfriend's closet? I haven't, but I have to. Good. I definitely plan to go. Okay. But I'm okay. always looking at pictures of what they have. <laughs> <laughs> right. So you're into it with us. Show us something if you were going to give us um, something. If I was going to give something, it would probably be... Don't hold this to this because we're just saying. <laughs> I might get it before you do. It might be this Chloe bag. I might ah, so see, you got it right here first. You might get to my girlfriend's closet. It might be sitting right there on the shelf. Now we want to talk about fashion trends. Was there one particular fashion trend that you were like, no, this has got to stay in my closet forever. It's my staple. I love it. Uh, what would that be for you? I think I have two. <laughs> which I can't seem to get over. Okay. So one would be the mummy jeans. The high waisted. I love those. I just love the fit. Yeah. <laughs> and um, just attracted to animal print. I love mm. it. I love it. I thought by now it would have gone, kind of gone, but I, 
it's still there and I'm glad for that anyway. Good old zebra. Yes. Good old tiger stripes. Stripes, yes. Good old. <laughs> Name them. <laughs> that's why we say I love she's them. feminine. But why? <laughs> A little bit of sex. That's the one I'm coming out. Okay. Yes. So uh, let me ask him now. If you had only one item that you could say would show your style, you said you'd like to show a little bit of the midriff yes. or the back. No. Show us that one item, an outfit. Uh, uh, oh, okay, I haven't worn this yet, but I quite like this. Um, yeah. So it's nice and summery and yeah. pretty. And, um, it looks big here, but it's not that. It just shows a little bit. You know, just enough. Just enough, exactly. Just enough. <laughs> so that's so I'm looking forward to wearing this. Oh, I can't <laughs> wait. This looks like amazing stuff. Your closet is the mummy of closets. The oh, mummy. Okay, of thank you. <laughs> we love your closet. Oh, thank now you. Now we're going to ask you, finally, online or physical shopping? Just physical. Physical shopping. Physical shopping. You're gonna have to wait a little. Yes, I know. <laughs> I miss it. <laughs> but yeah, I'm alone. an in-store girl. I know. <laughs> that in-store experience, yes. that touch, that feel. That's it's right. Gonna be all. That's right. Okay. Well, thank you so much. We cannot wait to get back wow. into your closet. We can't wait to see all of the items in my girlfriend's closet. Aww. Thank you so thank much you. for having thank us. Thank you. Thank you for even thinking. <laughs> thank, thank you. you. Karen, what are you giving us? <laughs> uh, I hope um, it's, it used to be my really, really favorite, favorite bags. You're getting this one of my favorite bags. Very versatile. And Amazing. It's a uh, Chloe Clutch. Oh, very <laughs> good. Look at this guy. So this is what you're guessing at my girlfriend's closet, 40 Alexandria. <laughs> For you, Alexandria Street, you'll be getting this fastest fingers only. Thank you. You're very welcome. Thank you. I have to say a big thank you to my girlfriend's closet for even thinking that my wardrobe was worthy of coming to visit me. Thank you, my girlfriend's closet. 